Hi everyone, how's it going? So here is the video everyone's been waiting for, including myself. I'm sorry I've not been present in the scrapbooking world. Um, I do a lot of other things on the side, including photography, which is what I had been doing. And also I just closed up for my last job for the <clears throat> for the summer, which I work at a coffee shop. So I'm closed all summer, but now I'm babysitting all summer. So finally finally got this done and I wanted to show you before I sh showed you the album I wanted to show you some of the uh, materials that I use so first off you've seen this in a few of my other albums the baby step cartridge um, I love this it's, it has some great fonts it has great images and um, just a lot of great things for the baby albums and then next I used this marquee stack no there it's a dcwv stack you guys know how i love my dcwv paper a lot of blues purples and creams in there and it's cool because it comes with some um some stuff you can put in your mini albums and then the other one i use is leblanc stack and it's kind of like a white creamy white color with some tan and silver um uh sheen to the pages so there's just a preview of some of those and lastly here is the album so the album itself the cover is nine by six and the inside of the album is eight and a half by five and a half so i add an extra half an inch on the cover <clears throat> and in the front i just have this like collection of flowers some of it is homemade others is just some that were bought and the pearl spray in the back is actually homemade as well then you come up here I have this little bow and then a book plate that the mom can either write the date or you know the name of the baby and then here is just the binding and I did cover the whole book with some glitter paper um, I love this glitter paper but the only thing is I can't use it in my Cricut because all the glitter gets loose and it gets on my sticky Cricut pad and I just don't like cleaning it after that. Actually, it's almost never the same after I do that. So, anyways, the page is, um, I mean, the book is six pages long as usual. So, let me go ahead and show you the inside. So, sorry about the lighting. Um, it's as best as I can do right now. It's four o'clock in the afternoon. So, <laughs> I'm really trying to get this done. And so, uh, anyways, in the front, I have my just arrived things that I made on my computer. And then this whole album has a lot of detail in it because it was meant to be for someone special and then they ended up changing their baby colors. So I'm going to have to make them another very special album. And um, this, of course, says Welcome Home Baby like I usually put in the beginning. And this is from the Baby Steps cartridge. I did make these bows um, with my envelope punch board. And this is just a little pocket page. Of course, I put some pearls, try to embellish the words a little bit. And I have some tags in here. <clears throat> so first tag, nothing on the back, it's just going to be blank. And then I have these little cute baby tags. They could either write on the back or just leave them there for embellishment. And then just some of these little tags. They could either put pictures on or write on them. But cool thing is these are also templates for some of the frames you will see in there. So um, this page says joyful up on top. We got two of these little journaling tags. And then I just threw this little bear in there. They could write on the back if they wanted. Um, but I just kind of put it in there just for looks. And then this um, this little dresser I made by hand. And I also colored this little towel by hand. So when you turn the page, this is diaper change on this one. And I put like little um, pacifier, diaper, and little safety pin. And when you lift it up, see there's an <clears throat> that picture frame where those templates go to. And um, this was just blank because I wanted it to just lay flat. And on this page it says baby and a little image. And I did add the wings because the wings weren't a part of the actual cartridge. But I wanted just like a little bit more uh, kind of like my own style instead of just straight from the cartridge. So with this one it is just a bow with the picture frame and then this one says mom and dad so when you open it up you can actually put a picture of mom and dad in there and then just a little baby bear with a tag there we go and it just slides right in Ooh, here we are and then um, 
butterflies, just embellishments on the back of this. And it says laugh right here with some butterflies and some pearls in the center. And then this word says cutest. And I did embellish the little tulips there. And then again, this has some tags just like the first pocket page. <clears throat> so yeah, like I said, a lot of went into this album. And then this one, so cute, taking a bath, which you're going to see in my next baby album because I really love the way this page came out with the little pearls as bubbles and um and this one is a little envelope that I cut the top off it's a special moments and there's a little tag in there just slides in of course they could always put extra pictures and then <clears throat> when you lift this up again there's another frame and it says grandma and grandpa and I figure they could put two pictures here or one big picture another smaller picture of course the choice is up to them and then the last page is our little girl and I just really love this little cloud and um, I, that's what I forgot to do I was gonna put a bow on the cloud so now that I'm looking at it I'm like it looks really plain up there <laughs> so yes I will be putting a bow on the cloud and of course this is open on the bottom right here so they can just slide a picture and that is it that is the end of the album so let me know what you guys think let me um work on my next project hopefully i can get it out soon and you guys have a wonderful day sorry it took so long and we'll see you soon bye